Hi, this is Judy in the Embroidery Department at Kaizenk, and today I'm going to show you how to delete files from your design file server if you don't want them there anymore. Uh, the LEM is a system that hooks your laptop or desktop computer, your um, Wilcom embroidery program directly to your embroidery machine. So instead of putting files on a flash drive or scanning them, you can just send them directly over there. So it's a nice system. Once you have it set up, I'm going to show you how you can delete files because sometimes you send files to the wrong machine by mistake or sometimes you send them over there and then find out, oh, the customer wants to change the size or something else on their file. So now you have files in there that you're looking at that are doing you no good. You, they don't need to be there. You want to delete them. How do you do that? Okay, so this is how the LEM works. So say I want to send this file, I just have it open and I want to send it to my single head machine. So this pink icon up here is my single head machine. Click on it, it says it's been sent, great. It's sent over there, now I go over there and I can download it. I have a separate video on that. But now I want to delete it, because it's in my way. I have this long list of things to look at and I don't want it there anymore. So I have this LEM junior design file server running in the background. If you don't, uh, make sure that it's open on your machine and all set up. Once it's running down here in the corner, I can click this icon and I see this little icon right here. It's blue and black. That is my LEM server. So here I have my designs that are sent to the forehead machine, designs that are sent to the six head, and designs that are sent to my single head. If I click down here in the visuals, if I right click, I get this menu. So I can move this one up to the top if I want, or I can delete it. I can delete whatever I want, then hit OK, and clear those files out so I'm not looking at them when I don't need to. Thanks for watching.